right, guys, let's get warmed up. Come on. Um, I don't want to play any kind of music today because basically YouTube um, won't let us put the, put the videos up if they can hear the music. Let's just do some jacks right here. A bit mean, I reckon. I hate working out without music. All right, just shake it out a little bit. Let's just do some nice deep squats right here. Slow and controlled. There we go. Get your feet wide so you can squat deep. Arms out in front. Then come on, you to hang down nice and low and do an alternating heel lift right here just to warm up those um, quads and hammies. And the calves too, actually. So I've already taught a class today. I did one um, earlier this morning for my gym push. Oh my gosh. We can have a little shake out. Take it to some foot fires, guys. There you go. Come on, get the first burner right here. Couple more. Three, two, and rest. Oh my god. All right, side lunge. Let's go. Nice. It's weird. I can see myself on two different screens. I'm going cross-eyed. <laughs> uh, so make sure you're sinking back into that lunge. Add that little hop if you want a bit more. There you go. Okay, reach same hand, same side. Nice little stretch through the side right there. Couple more, guys. Three, two, and one. Have a little shake out. So get your feet nice and wide. Let's reach down to the floor. Do that big stretch. Calf raise, glute squeeze. Make yourself as long as you can, guys. So I'm a bit sore actually. It's all good. I like it. It's fun. Let's do a little rotation and make sure you pivot, guys. Reach across your body. Couple more. Three, two, and have a little shaky shake. All right, let's do that nice, controlled, alternating reverse lunge. I'm getting warm. Anyone else? I'm in this garage. I kind of got cool today though. So I have my fan turned off for now. We'll see what happens. Out of rotation over the knee. Follow it with your face. So you're going to fall up body rotation. Three, two, just a couple more jacks just to get nice and loose. There you go. I'm just going to fiddle with the camera a bit. Keep going with those jacks, guys. That's the way. Keep doing your jacks. Sorry, a bit of heavy breathing right there. <laughs> and have a little shake it on down to the floor. Let's get into that plank. Let's do some mountain climbers. A couple of push ups. Some mountain climbers. Make sure those push ups count. Make them count. And push back into child's pose and just wriggle it around a little bit. There we go. Slowly come on up. So I'm hoping that you're warm. If you're only just joining us now, do like some squats and jacks, okay? So here's how it's gonna work. Today's a cross-training class, okay? We're gonna be alternating a core with a cardio move, okay? So we've got eight blocks. They're four minutes long each, around about. 40 seconds, two exercises, okay? Alternating them twice. So we're gonna be doing four intervals, then we go to the next block. Let me show you the first two movements. While I'm demonstrating, jog on the spot, do some jacks. Come on. So the first move, grab a couple of dumbbells or cans or whatever you've got going. If you've got nothing, don't worry, just use your arms. V sit, okay, with a fly. Holy cow, that's a toughie. You can do an alternating fly if you want to, but your back should be flat. Try and keep your feet up off the floor, all right? And we're doing that nice fly. That's move one. Move two is going to be two jump lunges into a squat jump. So lunge, lunge, squat jump. Lunge, lunge, squat jump. Take the jump out if you need to. So I have a, a timer here. I want you to listen for it. It gives you five minutes. Oh, five minutes. Five seconds to grab your dumbbells for the first move. V sit with a fly. Okay, here we go. Listen for the timer. 
Can you hear it? Be quiet. And let's go. You're in a V sit position and you're flying. It's a controlled movement. Soft bend in the elbows. Okay, try and keep your head off the floor. If, if you can't, don't worry. Do an alternating little heel tap if you need to. This is not an easy move. Try and keep your back flat. Lots of choices, you can alternate. Come on guys, you got 10 seconds. Keep going. Oh gosh. Come on. Couple more. And 10 seconds to get up. We're gonna do two jump lunges into one jump squat, okay? Two lunges and a squat. And go. One, two, and a little jump uh, squat in the middle. Two jump lunges into a jump squat. You've got a little bit of jump in action, yeah? Come on. We're past halfway. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so loud breathing. Oh my God. Come on, 10 seconds. Less than five, everyone finishes strong, come on. Nice job, hit back to the floor. V sit with a fly. Here we go. Three, two, go. Woo, we're working, don't worry. Make sure it's a controlled movement. Don't hold your breath, guys. Woo. Soft elbows. We just passed halfway. Try and keep your feet up. Do an alternate heel tap. If your back kicks in, put the weights down. Just use your arms. Five seconds. That's hard up to my um, lunge squat. Okay, everyone, come on back up. Here we go. Two jump lunges into a jump squat. Ready? And go. Come on. I need to almost do three to get back to center again. There you go. Come on. We're going to have two new exercises after this. Okay. We just passed halfway, guys. Go a little faster if you can. Come on. Stay low. 
gotta reach for it. You got it, come on. We're halfway. Woo. 15 seconds. Come on, come on. Five seconds. Keep going. Oh. All right, beautiful job, guys. Head back down to the floor. We're doing that bird dog. On your toes. Ready? Go. Oh. Switch it out in a controlled fashion. So try and hold each side for like maybe two, three seconds, okay? Before you switch. Then it kind of kicks in. These are not easy. Come on. We're well past halfway. You have 15 seconds left. Oh, golly. Come on. Five seconds. Finish with me, guys. Don't stop. Okay. Everyone up. Let's go. Let's hustle. Four touchdowns. Get ready for it. Two, one, go. Come on. Oh, golly. This is block B. We go up to H. <laughs> what the what? That's right. Two down, six to go. Come on, we're halfway through with these four touchdowns. You have about 10 seconds. Come on, come on. Finish it with me.
jumping jacks. Woo, come on. Yeah. I can't get back to you, little mini step bench. Grab the heaviest weight you've got. And we're doing the other side. Okay? Here we go. Oh gosh. It's a killer, yeah? Remember, no step, just do it on the floor with a little leg lift. Hang side, leg lift. Okay? We're halfway, guys, come on! Get ready for your plank jack times 10, jumping jack times 2. Come on! Go back down. 
Okay, I really do. Because <laughs> I am. Oh. Challenge yourself with a heavy dumbbell, okay? If you're doing this too easily, then you're going too light, okay? Try to keep your legs stable, okay? Come on, you've got about 10 seconds here. Oh. Listen for the buzzer. Nice. Okay, 10 butt kickers, five frog hops. Everyone up, come on. Butt kicks should be fast. Okay, fast, fast, fast. Go. Five frogs. Go back to the floor. 
I have a really bad lower back, unfortunately. It's pain, but it is what it is. I try and do some, and then I can feel it kicking in. Come on, guys, come on. Dropping too much, okay? Okay, we're gonna be doing an alternating side plank. If you want to add a push up to this, feel free, but you don't have to, okay? So, all it is, you're gonna plank and you're gonna hold it to one side for maybe three or four seconds, then you're gonna roll around to the other side for three or four seconds, like so, okay? If you want to add a push-up between that little rotation, feel free, okay? Um, what else have we got going? Travelling toe tap. So, pretty simple. Just doing your toe tap and you're travelling like this, okay? This is a really small kind of space, okay? Up and back, up and back. The heart rate should be going up pretty well. All right, so here we go. Rotating side plank, add a push-up if you want extra. Let's go. Everyone on the floor. Whew. I might add a push up because you can never do too many push ups, can you? Yeah? So make sure that you're pivoting on your feet. You sort of roll on your feet. Hold and stabilize it. Hips up high. Whew. Stack those feet, guys. Get your hips up. And a push up if you want, get extra. We've got about 15 seconds. Come on, come on. Don't stop. We've got about five seconds left. Use every single second. All right, come on, come back up. Traveling toe tap. We just toe tap it as fast as we can. Just up and down a couple of feet, okay? Get low, pull your arms. So I've got like these big gym tiles in here, like rubber tiles, I'm kind of doing two of those. Okay, so have a little spot you've got mapped out in your head, you kind of toe tapping it, pumping your arms, soft knees. Oh gosh, come on, go a little faster if you're not feeling anything, come on. 10 seconds guys. Stop. 
off knees. Okay? Good. Woo! Come on, this is the last time we can be doing this. Making your best one, okay? Last one, best one. Pump your arms, people. You should be like twinkle toes right here, okay? That's right. 15 seconds. Go a little faster. Come on, everybody. Hop and pop like me, I hope. <laughs> Come on. Woo. Yeah, there you go. That was a beauty. All right, we had two blocks left. We are crushing this workout. What time we got? It's only four. 33, I think, I don't know. <laughs> Again, I'm so blind. All right, two new exercises. If your heart rate drops, run on the spot, do some jacks. Okay, I love this move. I, obviously, we've done it before, but it's such a such an effective move. I like to do it. So, an isometric squat. Grab a light dumbbell or a can. If you have a really weak lower back, just don't use any weight at all, okay? You're gonna be low in that plie squat, which means your toes turned out okay and you're as low as you can go and we're going to drive the car with soft elbows okay so note that your butt is back you're not like this okay it's horrible on your knees do your jumping jacks all right move two and you'll be really excited about this one donkey kicks times four squat run times four this is going to really kill okay it's going to be fantastic so donkey kick these ones times four, then you jump up in a squat run, like you're throwing a tantrum, times four. Back to the kicks, woo! So here we go, isometric, plenty squat, driving the car. Is everyone ready? Of course you're ready. Okay, five seconds to grab your dumbbell. Get ready for it. Sinking to that low squat. It's gonna be hard guys, because you're a bit fatigued now. So, if your back kicks in, put the weight down and then just have your hands like this pretending that you're driving your car, okay? <sighs> Holy posterior right here. Try not to wear your shoulders as earrings, okay? Bring them down out of your ears. Try and relax. <sighs> nice relaxing Sunday drive here. <laughs> Come on, less than 10.
o'clock. That's a bit sad, isn't it? I feel like it went by really quickly. So, two. <laughs> Everyone have a breather right now. Because if you worked as hard as I just did, you're going to be pretty pooped. Let your heart rate come down a little. Have a drink. Towel off if you need to. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, our next two moves. The first one, grab yourself a couple of dumbbells. I'm just going to use eight pounders, okay? Some cans, whatever you got going. Don't worry if you haven't got anything. Just, just use body weight, okay? So, we're gonna, <laughs> sorry, I'm so out of breath. Same leg. So for the whole 40 seconds, you're going to be low, do it going in and out of that same leg curtsy lunge with a bicep curl. So that leg, so maybe if I do it this direction, comes right over to the side. Your butt should be really burning right there. Back to center, okay? Back to center, same leg, woo! That's move one. Now move two, in a similar vein to the, to the boxing stuff we've been doing, you're gonna fall down the floor, you're gonna get on the floor, you're gonna come on up really fast, and you're gonna do four, Front snap kicks. Fall back on the floor. Okay. You can bounce on up. Four front snap kicks. If you have really bad knees and you just can't do that, like fly on the floor and bounce up again, if you have a chair, you can maybe use the chair. Get yourself up off the floor a little bit, okay? So that's move two. So let's start with that curtsy lunge. Right leg. Let's do our right leg so we always know where we are when we come back to it. Okay, listen for the timer. Whew. So your right leg is going over and you're doing that bicep curl as you sink into the curtsy lunge. All right. Don't be having a curvy back. Oh gosh. Sink as low as you can without hurting your knees. Get that foot almost parallel to the one that you've got planted to the floor, okay? Sink into it. Get your guns out with those biceps. <laughs> Come on. Woo! Oh, golly. So here we go. Fold to the floor, bounce up like a little gazelle. Four front side, I've got sweat everywhere, sorry. Okay, here we go. Come on, fall down. Come on up. Get up, four front snap kicks. One, two, three, four. Fall back down. Woo! You can use your hand and help you get up if you need to, okay? You'd be creaky. Getting up and down off the floor is actually one of those tests that you can do to see how fit you are, um, essentially, okay? Make those kicks count, come on. Woo, come on. Oh, oh, cow. All righty, grab your dumbbells, left leg curtsy lunge with bicep curl. Left leg is lunging this time. Let's do it. Oh my gosh. So get as low as you can. Get that bicep curl in there. Remember, if your back kicks in, put the weights down. Slow and controlled. This is the second last interval, and then we finish the workout, guys. It's awesome. Woo! Holy cow. Less than five, come on. Knees a little bit dodgy today. 
Come on, we have about 10 seconds left of the entire workout, people. Come on. Oh, gosh. Can't do it without me, I tell you. Oh, we are done and dusted, guys. Oh, holy smokes. All righty. Well, that was pretty fun. I like that. Okay. Let your heart rate go down before you head on down to the floor to do a few stretches. Mm. Make sure you drink plenty of water, guys. <sighs>